You know, and our final touch, volunteers are the heart of the Goodman Community Center. That's for sure. And one of them makes this a very sweet place to visit. <laughs> Alexandra DeGrandis has been baking cakes here at the Goodman Community Center for 17 years. She bakes the cakes every Friday and freezes them. And twi twice a week, she ices and decorates the cakes and serves them to anyone celebrating a birthday. And that's not even the most amazing thing. Alexandra is legally blind. It just means a lot. It's I'm getting out and meeting the public and socializing with people and I hope that I'm doing something that makes them happy too and uh, somebody said well perhaps you should just celebrate birthdays once a month and I said no I'm gonna do each and every person because perhaps that person is alone and so I want them to feel special Alexander, she is amazing. That's, That's what, what a community is. center Excellent. is all about. All right, Michelle Lee rejoining us now. The phones are ringing off the hook. Thank you, everyone. Yeah, every of uh, every one of those phones are tied up. So, okay, we want to ever, to remind everyone to keep those phone calls coming in. Um, they're going to be open until 10 o'clock. But really quick, I do want to mention a couple of names because we want to give a special shout out to the Koenigs of Madison, Irene Sherman of McFarland, Faith Sobel of Monona, the Dierks of Guanakee, Jacob Young of Oregon, and look, you guys, uh, Barb gave me this I mean so many of these keep coming in sorry if I'm blocking you I mean there's just it's so busy here yeah, really we've had great. such and, a great turnout and there's a matching pledge going on as well absolutely I uh I can't remember the number off the top of my head but just trust lot. me it's a All lot right. <laughs> call in everyone thanks for watching we'll continue our coverage at 6 and 10 have a good night